Hi guys, Jason Starn here with Cenesis. Hey, I want to show you how to get your network license for Maya. This is uh, always seems to be a, a very hard thing to do, and I don't know why, but uh, I want to make this video so that uh, everybody can see how this is done. So once you get your license certificate after you've purchased Maya, it's going to have a serial number on there and a product key, right? And so it's also going to show you things like how many concurrent users you can have. This is a floating license and that's what this video is for, for a network server. So how do I get my license for a network server from Maya for two people? So the way to do that is you want to use um, Firefox or Internet Explorer and you're going to go to register.autodesk.com and that will redirect to this address, registerwants.autodesk.com and it'll come up to this page here and you're just going to log in with your the normal login and password that you use to get into the subscription center or or when you're registering a product. So once you log in, it's going to come to this registration page here and you can choose your operating system that you're trying to get um, running here and then you're going to put your product serial number in. So you just copy that and paste it here, hit next, and it's going to basically pull up your account info uh, to register and then you're going to see your different accounts that you have under that so we'll choose that account hit next from here we get the ability to create the actual license file so if this is a single server we're going to put in a single server host name which i believe the host name of this machine is that and then you're going to put in the server id which is basically uh, eth0 of your server or your mac address for eth0 or en0 so you put that in, you hit next, and next page is going to generate, generate, please wait, go get a drink of water, come back, and bam, now we have our license file. And that is it.